Hey subs, so I've got this Fitbit that tracks my sleep and I'm um, looking forward to being in Wi-Fi because I think the last, it's probably a week now, I've slept more than I've slept my entire life. Like, I mean, like I'm sleeping 12 hours a night and then napping the entire day, which really I'm just sleeping all day and waking up randomly to drink water, to eat a snack. So like the highly productive part of me is just beating myself up. Like something's wrong. I keep thinking something must be wrong, but I'm still every day. Like I'm shoveling the snow. I took all the Christmas decorations down yesterday. I'm showering daily. I'm like I'm eating significantly less, but I'm also like, I'm not doing anything. I'm not working out. I'm not doing anything. So like every day I'm still doing like a productive activity or two or 10, but like I'm sleeping probably, if I sleep eight hours a night, I'm probably getting like I'm gonna look at my Fitbit when I get to Wi-Fi. So I wonder, like, is this just like, like it's freezing cold out. I no longer have a job, we don't have Wi-Fi. I haven't had any kids all week. And so, I don't know, I have no idea. I'd like to be able to like, like plug in, like you plug in a car and you see what's wrong with them. <laughs> see if there's something wrong with me or if it's like, no, Connie, it's okay to sleep. That's what my friends keep telling me, but it's so, it's so unlike me to sleep this much that it makes me concerned. There's like this numbness to me. Like when someone wants to do something, I'll happily like get up and get around and go meet and do things. But if I don't have plans, I'm just sleeping. So right now I am because I do have homework <laughs> that I can't do because every time I try, I just fall asleep. But I head to Panera to sit there and try to get some studying done. So, I'm up. I'm in my happy place right now. year at this time I um, had been seeing a dude for like a year I um, little did I know but a month later I would be raising a kid and I was the director of CCJ throughout the year as the director of CCJ and I was raising my son in serenity and now it's a new year and the things that have been who I am are changed they're it's all different now not the director of CCJ. I'd always um, drive by and I'd think, like I'd check on the building, make sure it's, uh, there's, every everything's okay in it. What's going on or whatever. I'm trying to open my garage door. There we go. There, I got it. Um, so I, now I drive by and think, mm -mm, that's not mine anymore. I also just dropped off Serenity's school stuff. She is hoping to, to move back. She spent the holiday there and she feels she and her grandparents, grandma and her dad all feel like she's ready. They had no major hiccups. And really the goal, oh, I cannot see. The goal is for her to live at home. So it looks like that might be happening. So, whew, that's a big change too. Oh, I feel, I feel the weight of no CCJ and no serenity. I might be ready for bed.